So one of the things I know we all deal with as airbrush artists is organization. And I came with an idea and I'm going to work it out with you. We're going to look at it together and see if it works. So as you see here, I went to uh, Family Dollar and this cost me three dollars and thirty something cents but not a dollar at the dollar store. Anyway, it's one of those uh, utensil organizers. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a drawer that I have and I'm going to use this organizer here and see if uh, we can uh, utilize this as a good organizational tool. See, this is everything that's here. You see, it's somewhat organized, but not quite right so I think if we were to put this in here it might work so let's check this out together so here's the drawer I was talking to you about where I have a little bit of everything this of course is the utensil like forks knives spoons it's these organizers here is the drawer as you can see I don't need these things I don't use them hardly ever so they really shouldn't be in my drawer uh, I have this new rule if I don't touch it at least once in a week it's not going to be readily accessible I'll have to go and find it in its proper place so I got rid of this box unnecessary I use q-tips to clean my airbrush so I have them here but I don't need 10,000 of them I can put these somewhere and replenish when needed the one pen one pen you're always looking for <laughs> you know when you are you know trying to write a check or send a label to uh, send out some ink or something like that so the one pen is going to go here so and then of course this is like a little tackle box like I said I don't go in it every at least once every two weeks so it goes off to the side so this is what I have here for the white pastel in my in my technique I have it all there so that's really good so you see right there we can zoom in Whoop. see right there for the white pastel and then right here I have my erasers you know like my uh, my favorite castell perfections my monos which are really fantastic so that goes right here I'll know exactly where they are every time these are my pencils and my crow quill so this is all the black that I use I'm also going to put uh, my one paintbrush in there for when I do the uh, fine details in my India ink airbrush paintings so here are my q-tips my one utility knife, wrench, everything I need to work on my airbrush. Some cups, you know, if I'm ever needing to break out some ink and do some uh, brush work. I have my digital, for my digital tablet, the pen, and some rulers. And of course, those who watch my live streams know about this, is Blackbeard Wheat. Put my gloves, scrap paper, and that's it and this is going to go in my drawer so all this other stuff unnecessary uh, it is necessary but not every day so that's so that's that so it's definitely a success so I definitely think it's something that you should explore dollar store spoons and knives organizer and I think this is a winner as you can see this is the drawer and look how great that looks everybody Looks so fantastic.